the egg that fled. When Jimmy cracked an egg, things didn't go to plan. He had to blink, out popped a chick who fell into the pan. Hey man, it's red hot in here. What do you think I am? I expected yolk. Is that a joke? Get me out this frying pan. When Jimmy scooped him out, his butt was burnt and black. Are you mad? What kind of dad fries a kid for morning snack? There, kid, I'm not your dad. There's been a mix-up at the coop, so take me back. If I do that, you may end up as chicken soup. Soup? No way, that cannot be. I'm sorry, but it's true. Or you may be munched for Sunday lunch on a summer barbecue. Say what? No way, when I'm big, I'll fly away, for my wings won't be so brittle. Well, sure you'll grow. But don't you know, your wings stay kind of little. That's not right. It cannot be. Oh, it be. You'll be trapped there, don't you see? Maybe you could take care of me. I could be your cool new pet. That sounds like fun. I'll call you John. Now let's take you to the vet. The vet took one look at them, then scratched his ginger beard. What to think? His first pet chick... It really was quite weird. Well, John's a healthy chick. Nothing wrong with him at all. Yes, John grew strong, but his wings stayed very small. Then, one dark and starry night, a shadow prowled in the moonlight. On four red paws, with four sharp claws, Fox came looking for a bite. He crept into the garden, as John lay down and snored. A big fat chicken, my lips I'm licking, I'll eat him up for sure. Fox sneaked up on the sleeping John and rubbed his greedy tongue. But down swooped Owl without a sound and pecked him on the bum. Ah! Fox let out a howl, all thanks to Owl, and ran off through the trees. Don't live in fear, it's safer here. Fly up and stay with me. Oh, Owl, I wish I could, but my wings are very small. I keep flapping, but nothing happens. They don't seem to work at all. But what if I'm out flying when Fox next comes to hunt? For if I'm gone, then watch out, John, or Fox will eat you up for lunch. So John called on his two good friends, on Jimmy and wise owl. Your brains together must save my feathers when Fox next comes to prowl. They sat and thought for hours, then at last made a decision. Let's build a cage. Hey, this chick's free range. Besides, I'm not in prison. Wise owl whispered in Jimmy's ear. I've just had a great idea. They slapped high five, jumped on their bike, and cycled to Ikea. To fly has always been your dream. We've bought you something as good as wings. Your very own trampoline. So if hungry fox should e'er come back, teeth bared all set to pounce, John can fly up to the sky in one tremendous bounce. Now John sleeps with the owlets in Owl's nice comfy nest. They stay together, these friends with feathers, and John's a welcome guest. As for Fox, he's still there. His lips he's still a-licking. But he'll never catch our hero John, the world's only flying chicken. The end.